Hey my gems, it's your girl Riss and I'm back here again with another video. As you can see, I am starting my day. I just finished my makeup and I am currently taking down my rod set that I did the night before just so I can have a curly hairstyle. Today we have a few days planned. We are actually going to a vending event. I am vending my jewelry for ladies night out and here is the finished product of the hair and makeup. So cute. Now, let's go get breakfast. That Mary Ann's breakfast. <laughs> It is a few days later and I'm on my way to take my son to baseball practice. All right, my gems, as you can see, I'm in a different room. My hair and makeup is done. I'm going to take some pictures and I'm going to let you guys see, you know, a little bit behind the scenes. I did want to make sure my makeup was done, but my outfit is going to be fairly no outfit, really. Let me show you what I'm taking pictures in exactly. Okay, yeah, so. What I'm taking pictures in is uh, this oversized sweatshirt. It says proud supporter of messy hair and sweatpants. It's just pretty much really going to be a comfortable photo shoot um, like in its natural element type thing with natural lighting. So hopefully that's what I'm trying to come across is really, really natural type setting. I will have jewelry on. I just want to take pictures of my jewelry in like a different element. Something that comes off pretty much natural, easy going. So instead of me always pairing my jewelry with uh, elegant outfits, um, chic styles, I just want to take the back seat a little bit and uh, give more of a round the way type vibe that you can also wear with the jewelry. So let's see with this oversized sweatshirt will be given. Okay, so let's go do that. 
also before i forget i wanted to say that i actually found a new foundation i am getting more comfortable doing my makeup i actually purchased a new um foundation type makeup so i don't know i'm just trying it out i got some sample bottles and i'm just trying to figure out this whole makeup thing but i can tell you when i do take my pictures um is this a lot of editing that goes into when you you know taking pictures so now that i'm actually doing makeup it's just it's just less editing on the pictures itself if my face is put together somewhat with some makeup on and the pictures just come off like to me a little bit more professional a little bit more put together if you're liking what this is giving definitely leave me a comment you know because i'm just trying out this makeup journey on camera so All right, so I just got up the shower. Now I'm about to just go in with my skincare routine. Shout out to Elizabeth Payton on Instagram. You can check her out. I used her foaming face wash in the shower. And I'm also going to use her rose and vitamin E serum. It says this serum locks in moisture, has benefits of helping with cell regeneration, dark spots, reduce scars, and fine lines. So I'm also going to use her serum. I'm also going to use this e.l.f. serum. It's a beauty shield. It has vitamin C in there. I also have this new calming toner. It is called uh, Yes 2. And it's a cucumber soothing toner for sensitive skin it has witch hazel olive burner and it's alcohol free and it has natural ingredients that is the toner so we're going to go in with the toner first just get a cloth and it feels so good like it really calms and cools down my skin it's soothing like it says I have been using it for a couple of days now and I really like it right after I wash my skin it just really brings a calmness to my face and I'm actually gonna go in with the elf beauty shield serum and I'm just going to put a few drops under my eyes Okay, so with the drops under my eyes, I'm going to take my Natural Jade Face Roller and rub that in. If you do not have a face roller, I would definitely say get a face roller, preferably a Natural Gemstone one if you can. Because Natural Gemstones tend to be cool like very cool to the touch so what the face roller does basically is just help push and move the blood around in your face and get great circulation in your face so i tend to take a minute rolling the face roller under my eye just to smooth out those bags under there Cause I have some bags. You may not can tell, but I can tell. Okay. Think of it like a, a pastry roller or a piece of dough roller or something. You know how the dough is pretty much fluffy and fat until you roll it out and it's nice and smooth. 
That's pretty much what this does to your face. I'm gonna wash this tool off and wash my hands. Okay, hands are nice and clean. And I'm gonna go ahead and take some of Elizabeth's Patent Rose and Vitamin E Serum. And I'm gonna take a few drops and put it all over my face. Get the neck. And there you have it. That is my skin routine. All right, my gems, I'm actually going to start cooking dinner for my family. As always, it's been a pleasure sitting down chatting with you. Be sure to like, share, and comment your favorite part on the video. And until next time, bye, my gems.